Lennon Stella is a rising star who has some chart-topping hits at the moment and is only 19 years old at the time of this recording. She was discovered as a kid and in my opinion, she has always been extremely musically talented. To some, she's fairly new to this scene, but if you're anything like me, you know her from the TV show Nashville, where she played Maddie. When she started on the series alongside her real-life younger sister Maisie, she was really young and looked completely different than now. Although both Lennon and her sister were cast on Nashville, around the same time in 2012, they also performed a cover of the song Call Your Girlfriend on YouTube. It was a hit and it got them a lot of publicity, as well as an invitation to play on Good Morning America. These days with Nashville wrapping up in 2018, Lennon is focusing on her solo music career. Although Lennon has an interesting story and is a fellow Canadian, this video is going to focus more on changes to her look than anything else. On that note, there isn't yet a Before They Were Famous on Lennon, so if that's something you'd like to see, let us know. What's going on guys and girls? My name is Kara and this series we've titled Before and After. We're going to talk about Lennon's look over the years, including any changes, her style, and more. I've done other celebrity transformation videos on stars like Bella Hadid and Ariana Grande, and we'll have links to those at the end of this video. If there's anyone else you want me to document, let me know in the comments down below. Now let's get into this video. Let's start with Lennon's face. Like I mentioned, the girl has changed a lot over the years. When she got her start on Nashville, she was your typical cute little kid with glasses, and now she's all grown up. To be fair, when I was around the age Lennon was at the beginning of Nashville, say like 12, I also looked different and rocked glasses. Safe to say between the years of 12 to 19, someone is entitled to look more mature. She has even commented in a recent interview about people saying that she's changed, stating, I'm like, I just grew up, you just watched it. You know what I mean? People just can't stand the fact that I don't look 12 anymore. That's frustrating for me now. I struggle with that. Nowadays, it seems that Lennon has stitched her glasses, so I'm guessing she either wears contacts or has gotten laser eye surgery to correct her vision. This occurred while she was still starring in Nashville, and although this is certainly responsible for a big change in her look, I don't think it's the only major change. Aside from multiple hair changes, which I'll talk about a little bit later, Lennon seems to have different lips than her early days. The stars addressed these rumors more than once, and she said she hasn't gotten lip fillers, but I find that kind of hard to believe. Even around her 17th birthday, her lips started looking fuller in Instagram photos. I know that lip liner works magic, but I don't think so much that it gives you an entirely new set of lips. And this has been her defense for the most part. Reminds me a little bit of Kylie Jenner's excuse, which ended up being just that, an excuse. I'm guessing that Lennon does get some sort of fillers in her lips to get them looking so full. I mean, with Lennon Lennon still being a teen, she may not want to admit to fans that she gets fillers, but I really don't see the shame in it. So many people have lip fillers nowadays and it's not a big deal. Whatever she's done with her lips certainly made her look more grown up and she looks gorgeous. I always admire her and think she looks hot when she posts on Instagram. Anyways, aside from Lennon's bigger lips and getting rid of the glasses, I don't think there have been any other drastic changes to her face. She has a great nose, but I'm pretty sure it's always been like that. The only thing that has been added is the nose ring, which I'm a fan of, clearly. Moving on to Lennon's hair and makeup, she seems to have experimented quite a bit already. It appears that she's a natural brunette, which is how she was introduced on Nashville, and the hair color she's had for a while. Closer to the end of the series, she went blonde. She only lightened it slightly at first, but then went for an icy platinum blonde. I loved it on her and she pulled it off for sure. This wasn't the end of the hair changes though, and Lennon went back to a darker shade of blonde when she was sick of the platinum. She's even tried a bit of pink. A dark brown or black came next, and this even looked hot. Looking at photos, I can't decide what color looks best. I didn't think it was possible for someone to look equally gorgeous in every hair color they try, but I love it all on her. Lennon's makeup look seems to vary, but it seems that she goes for a more natural makeup style when she's not on the job or performing. Not to mention she looks flawless without makeup too, and seems to have glowing skin. One thing I noticed with her though is that her lashes are always looking super long, so my guess is that she has lash extensions. Another thing I love about Lennon is her style. I think now that she's grown up, she's gotten more edgy, and the outfits she chooses show off her personality. I'm always envious when she posts photos and outfits because it's totally stuff I'd love to wear. Her fashion seems to be a mix of classy, vintage, and trendy, and she totally looks great when she's glammed up as well. Altogether, Lennon is a gorgeous and talented lady whether or not she's changed. Being in the public eye and on TV since she was a little kid, it's predicted that people are going to analyze whatever she has or hasn't gotten done to her look. With the amazing music she's been putting out and how she's been sharing her beautiful voice with the world, I think things have only really started to take off for her. I hope to see a lot more of Lennon in the near future. All right, guys and girls, that wraps up this video here on Before and After. If you want to talk more about Lennon's transformation, you can hit me up on Instagram. Let me know who else you would like me to make a Before and After video on, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!